Linguistics is a scientific study of language, but what is it that makes linguistics a science? Science is generally divided into three branches, the natural sciences, the social sciences, and the formal sciences. Linguistics actually touches on all of these branches. The natural sciences are generally divided into the life sciences and the physical sciences. Under the life sciences, linguists study things like articulatory phonetics, which is the physiology of how we produce speech sounds. We also look at language evolution, how we evolved these speech organs, and also how we evolved the cognitive capacities to do language. Linguists also study neurolinguistics, which is the science of how language works in the brain. Under the physical sciences, linguists study acoustic phonetics, which is looking at the physical properties of speech sounds. Now, a lot of linguistics falls under the second branch of the sciences, the social sciences. For example, sociolinguistics looks at how demographics like age, gender or ethnicity influence and shape language. Historical linguistics can actually reconstruct what ancient languages were like using modern evidence, and linguistic archaeology triangulates data from historical linguistics, population genetics, and archaeology to better understand human history. Linguistics can also be thought of as a formal science because there are many linguists out there that believe that language can be studied as an independent, formal, abstract, mathematical system. So it's pretty clear that a lot of what we study in linguistics falls very squarely under the umbrella of science. Linguistics is also a very quantitative field. In corpus linguistics, we look at huge databases to get statistics about how people are using certain words or grammatical features and how they change over time, or correlate to other types of variables, again, such as demographics. We can use the same kind of mathematical models that are used in phylogenetics and biology to look at language relatedness. Many linguists also conduct psycholinguistic experiments to look at the effect of certain variables on how we produce speech. And because spoken language is an acoustic waveform, we can study the properties of that waveform and quantify it. We can actually quantify where you pronounce vowels in the mouth. The field of linguistic typology also looks at the patterns that we see across languages and often comes up with statistical universals about what types of things are possible or not possible or likely or unlikely in language. And a lot of sociolinguistics also works with a lot of survey data as well, which requires a lot of statistical processing. So while traditionally linguistics was very much a humanities and it was studied like a humanities field, one that was focused more on introspection rather than empirical data, today linguistics is very much an empirical science.